Hey everybody, say hello to Tony Joe Clapton. As the story goes, Eric Clapton was having prototypes made for his signature Eric Clapton Fender Strat. And uh, he gave one of the prototypes to Tony Joe White. Tony Joe White really liked the neck, didn't care much for the, the pickups or what it was doing. So he gave it to his nephew, Chet Hinesley, who's a good friend of mine. Well, it sat in Chet's closet for quite a while. He didn't do anything with it. It was just a body and the pickups. And so he gave it to me because he knew I'm a big Clapton fan. Mm. Well, I've had it for probably four or five years now. And I've been hanging out with Donnie Miller, Cheapo Casters. And uh, I was telling him about it. He said, well, I got a neck that I think will fit it. So he uh, fitted me a neck on here and set it up. And it's just too cool. It really is. I've been playing it all morning, tweaking on it a little bit. And, uh, man, it's just a cool little guitar. Definitely one of a kind, and uh, it's got a cool story with it. So uh, it's one of those stories you hope's true. I'm playing through a cheap old pawn shop amp here, maybe about a five water, so it's already breaking up a little bit. But that's just a normal, uh, what's that? The bridge, it's a bridge in the middle pickup. I'll just kind of scroll through them here so you can see what they sound like. Both together. It's got some cluck. Middle by itself. pickup which is my favorite pickup on a strat tremolo set up really nice it's floating Donnie made it floating and it stays in tune pretty darn well as long as I don't go crazy with it. Come back in. Okay, so that's just normal. But check this out. It's got a preamp built in. All the Clapton models do. Normally the Clapton model has it on the second tone knob, or the first tone knob, depending on which way you're looking at it. But, uh, it's on the back one end of this one, and it's about a 30 dB boost. It's really strong. Without. Seems to add some overtones that aren't, aren't there when it's not in there. I hear that clug. But then I hit it in. Seems to add some beef to it. And here's the other thing, you can dial in how much you want. So it'll go from kind of kind of dirty all the way to just massive. Oh, I should do this in B if Donnie's watching. So it might go something like this. 
think that's where I like it the best, just subtly on. Uh, take much to be Joe Clapton, that's what I'm going to call it. Donnie Miller, Cheapo Casters. I'm Shane. See you later. Bye.